I am not going to give the eastern part of my state away. As governor, I will not give an inch. I'm not going to make eastern Oklahoma reservation. I'm going to preserve our legal arguments. Uh, here's what people don't, don't, most people don't understand or they're ignoring. The tribes could still buy a gas station, go through the process to turn it into a um, trust land, petition the Department of Interior to put that in trust. Actually, 7% of our state is already in trust. So when the tribe buys a piece of land, they petition the Department of Interior and they put it into trust. Then it comes off our tax rolls. We don't get paid property tax on it. But with this new, new language, what they're hoping to do is turn 42% of our state into a reservation. Um, I, I don't think that's good for Oklahomans. I don't think people in Tulsa want that to happen. Um, McGirt, on the McGirt ruling, it said that reservation was still in existence for the major crimes only. And now you're seeing uh, the tribal governments argue that the reservations exist for all purposes. They're pushing for taxes on income taxes. They're pushing for uh, the city of Tulsa not to have authority to write speeding tickets. So that's what I mean by moving to a reservation for all purposes.